A woman gave birth to a monster after three years of pregnancy. The midwife was so scared that she ran away from the door. The husband, with tears in his eyes, held the baby to his wife. The woman said excitedly, Get rid of this monster. The husband could not bear it. After all, it was his own child. He put his wife's hand on the child's hand. Calm down, the woman also figured out. They agreed to bring up the child. The next day, the woman was sleeping. A vine reached in, then it transformed into a green human form. He seemed to have an inexplicable affection for the woman and the child. Looking at the sleeping baby, the man's eyes became tender. Just then, the woman woke up. She questioned him who he was. So the man told her a strange story. Three years ago, a girl was killed by her lover and fell into the water. When her life was in danger, a strong arm saved her. He was a tree demon from the neighborhood. He was attracted by the girl's beauty and fell in love with her. In a trance, the girl's hands and feet were tightly bound by a vine. So one person and one demon. In this hidden river, indescribable things happened. After hearing the story, the woman obviously did not want to believe that the child was born to her and the tree demon. But the strange appearance of the child made her sway again. The tree demon wanted to take the child away. The woman tried to stop it. At that moment, the amulet on her waist shone with golden light. The tree demon suddenly had a splitting headache. Her husband and mother-in-law heard the commotion and came to check. When they entered the room, the tree demon had already fled. The man soothed his wife, saying that everything would be fine. But they didn't know. The talkative midwife had spread the news that the woman had given birth to a monster. Soon the villagers came to their door. They wanted to kill the demon child. The woman insisted that her child was not a monster, asking everyone to disperse. But the midwife wouldn't let her go. She lifted the silk scarf wrapped around the child. Now even the villagers were stunned. It was really a demon child. The crowd was instantly set off. The husband's brother saw the situation was not good, grabbed a shovel to cover the two to leave. But after all, he was outnumbered. He was soon beaten down by the villagers. The couple asked an older man for help. He did not agree at first, but when he saw the baby in his arms, he was immediately frightened and fled. At that moment, the villagers also caught up with them. The two immediately got into the car, rode away on the motorcycle in a hurry. Who knows the motorcycle broke down halfway. The couple had no choice but to hide in a dark forest. The villagers refused to let the couple go and kept chasing them. In the nick of time, a bizarre scene appeared. Countless vines grew on the ground, and more and more, finally wrapping the mother and daughter up tightly. When the villagers saw this phenomenon, they fled the place in fear. In the trees, the mysterious man's hand glowed green, and it was the tree demon. But he did not have any good intentions, attempting to take the mother and daughter for himself. The woman clutched her child, hysterical. The husband swung his sword at the tree demon, but could not hurt him. Suddenly, he thought of a way to give his wife the ancestral amulet. At once, the golden light shone with great splendor. All the vines were dispersed. The two of them escaped safely. The village could not stay any longer, so the couple took a boat to a new city. They found a secluded place and decided to raise their child here. Time passed quickly, and the baby in the cradle grew into a lively end lovely little girl. In the front is the older sister, Carla, and in the back is the younger sister, Mia. They looked at each other in the mirror every day, singing happy songs, until one day, the sister's secret was discovered by a girl with the same strange look. 